Hi friends, welcome back. So in this video, we will learn about what are the roles and responsibilities of a manual tester. As a manual tester, your job is to ensure whatever the requirements are provided, you will be tested based on that requirement. That is the first thing. The second thing is you will be attending all the user story walkthrough meetings with uh, various stakeholders like uh, product owner, business analyst, so that you can get an idea of what are the user stories all about. That is the second thing we do. And the third thing we do as a manual tester is once we get uh, all the user story walkthrough to us, then uh, we'll be working closely with uh, developers, BAs and POs uh, to get it any clarification uh, post walkthrough about those user stories so that uh, we get the right understanding of those requirements so that we can proceed further uh, to write the test scenarios and uh, test cases. That is the next thing we do as part of uh, as a manual tester role. And once uh, we are able to write the test scenarios uh, and test cases, same thing we would be required to review as well. Maybe we can say some of the peer reviews can be done by the other your co-worker, your manual tester, or it could be reviewed by some test lead or a senior person, or even it can be reviewed from the developer and BA as well. So that uh, whatever the test scenarios or test cases which we return is appropriate as per the given user story. The next aspect from the manual tester is you will also be ensuring that because there are chances that the requirements are getting changed sometime. Whenever requirements are getting changed even appropriately our test cases also we have to keep updating and that is also the role of a manual tester. And once we are able to write test scenarios and test cases and we will be finalizing all the cases so that uh, next job is to prepare the test data requirement in order to execute uh, given uh, test cases because test data creation plays a major role in any software testing project without right test data our test case execution won't be 100% perfect because of that this is a very key in any manual tester role which is test data creation and once the test data is ready and our test cases are ready and then what we have to do is we have to prepare or arrange a test environment. Test environment is nothing but where the developer's code is deployed so that we can access the application to execute our test cases against that uh, environment which is called as a test environment. Once we execute the test cases, the test cases can be a sanity test cases, smoke test cases, functional test cases or regression test cases. Any of these test cases post executions we should be required to be analyzed as well. Once the execution is certain we are required to analyze the test results we got out of those uh, test case execution then post that we should be log the defects if you are seeing any disparity against actual versus expected results and when we are able to find those issues then we should be able to log the bug or a defect into the defect tracking tool that is also another roles and responsibility of a manual tester. So once uh, we are able to log the defects then the next thing is we need to reach out to the development team so that we provide all the necessary information to the developers or other stakeholders so that they can resolve that bug or a defect at the earliest. That is also a responsibility of a manual tester. You should also prioritize the given test cases which they return. They should uh, prioritize the test cases which are high, which are medium and which are critical so that uh, based on the availability of the timing so that they can prioritize only I or only medium or combination of these test cases so that we can cover within a given uh, time. Developers uh, fixes the issues then uh, the tester's job especially manual tester job also to re-verify those uh, bugs and defects is also another crucial aspect or a crucial role uh, from manual tester perspective. 
It is also a responsibility of the manual tester to provide all the relevant information related to any bug or defect which are in the system to the developer or any stakeholder. That is also another responsibilities. And also manual testers responsibilities also involve and he would be or she would be as a manual tester should be able to attend daily scrum meetings if you are working in agile model then daily stand up meeting also you are required to be attending on regular basis as well another key aspects uh, in terms of uh, roles and responsibility of uh, manual tester is not just uh, rating test cases or executing a test cases and also there is a huge contribution should be done in terms of innovation that is also a key thing these days as a manual tester you should be able to contribute certain innovation or in innovative ideas while executing the test cases or finding more issues in less time. Everything you should uh, adopt here in order to so that you can provide as much as innovation possible for a given project. And the next thing uh, from manual tester perspective is as a manual tester your job is to because you have written all the test cases on your own it could be test scenarios or test cases you will be knowing all the details about that functionality then your responsibility becomes very high so that you will be handing over the knowledge to the automation team so that uh, in future they can bring the test automation uh, stuff for these uh, manual test cases that your roles also involves if you are working in uh, agile then you will be working closely with uh, scrum master if you are working in any other model where you will be working closely with a test lead or a test manager that is also your responsibility where you will be continuously interacting with the stakeholders and provide as much as information possible so these are the certain things uh, you will be required to perform the day-to-day -day activity as a manual tester in any project in software testing. I am hoping you guys got a clear idea now what are the roles and responsibilities of a manual tester. If you guys really like this video then please give a thumbs up to this video. If you guys are not subscribed then do subscribe. Thanks for watching this video. Bye for now. Take care.